Welcome to the third part of the end of financial year series. Now that the start of the financial year is near, let's get started with planning your budget and goals for the year. This is the perfect time to reset, reevaluate, and prepare for the year ahead. Before you can begin to manage your money, you need to identify what is important to your business. As an example, is it important for you to expand your business or hire more staff? Does this mean that your goal is to save money or make money to buy that new office? You need to set clear goals for your business to set the targets you are aiming for and which helps you build your business plan. First off, let's understand budgets and its benefits for your business. Many people view that word budgets as limited and no money to spend. But did you know that budgets can guide you in the right direction as it is a plan on how you'll be spending your money? Budgets illustrate a clearer picture of your financial position. You may set goals to track your revenue, expenses and cash flow to ensure your journey to success is moving forward. Before creating your budget, review the year's profit and loss report. Have a look at your cost of goods sold and your expenses. Then you need to reflect. Were there any unexpected costs or expenses you didn't budget for in the previous year? Now review this year's plan. Do you have any new activities that you expect to result in increased costs? Make sure to get some help and make an appointment with your accountant. Our budgeting tool is simple and easy to use, which allow business owners to set their goals and keep track of their budgets by comparing it against actual results, especially if you've been running your business for a few years. So just make sure you sit down with your accountant or bookkeeper to review your budget. Let's start creating a budget on Reckon 1. To do this, go to Reporting and then Budgets. If you are new to the software, just simply click on Add. And once you've named your budget, enter all the data you need to for expected income in the Incomes tab. Make sure you save your data. Then move on to the Expenses tab and enter all the expenses you expect to pay for the year. You'll notice on the bottom left, you have the Change Values button and there are a few actions you can do. You can set all to same value, increase by percentage, decrease by percentage, smooth and average. Then you may select your months and the accounts it applies to. Once you have finished entering all your data, you may save your budget. How many of you are excited to start the financial year with a bright and shiny intention to run your business up to a budget? While it's natural to lose focus and not engage regularly, it is essential to return for continual assessment to track your finances. Make sure you regularly check your profit and loss and budget report on a monthly basis. In Reckon 1, you can regularly monitor your budget against actual results.